Hi, my name is Jasmine and I am a member of Church of God of Prophecy and my local church is Restoration House in Manchester, Moss Lane East. I think as a young person in the UK at present things are very interesting as things change very quickly and very frequently. I think people are starting to realise that they have a voice and they're starting to use that voice. We've just been through a pandemic and things are changing and we've had to adapt and I think it's been young people that have really been at the forefront of that. My faith plays a key part in overcoming any kind of obstacle or challenge that I may face. It is something that doesn't cost anything but is so valuable and absolute treasure because it's got me through things when nothing else helped and nothing else got me through that situation. Hello, my name's Andrina. I am from Birmingham. Um, I think that growing up in the UK was really positive. I found there was a lot of opportunities for me, lots of things that I could do and participate in. Um, and as I look around now, I see there's even more um, opportunities and things that young people can do. So I think it's it's positive being a young person growing up in the UK. Uh, my faith does help me a lot overcome challenges that I face. Um, it's kind of like the bedrock of my life. It's the cornerstone. It's what I cling to. It's what I hold to. Um, and God has helped me see. A, oh, God has helped me come through a lot of challenges. Um, so yeah, my faith is really, really important to me. And I definitely welcome the church's input. I think anything that churches can do to encourage young people um, and to improve things for them is really positive. So yeah, I think it's a good idea, good move. Hello, uh, my name is Sergey, and I'm a member of the New Testament Assembly Tooting Church um, in the United Kingdom. Um, so for me personally, um, my faith is uh, massive, to be honest. It's massive in... Um, in negotiating everyday life to be honest um i feel like for me when yeah, th there'll be times where I, I might be feeling a little bit overwhelmed or i might be feeling a little bit um just just not exactly sure how i'm going to get through the situation that i'm currently in but um because of my my grounding because of my upbringing um, um in the church i've been uh saved for a, a while i'm i'm super grateful for my faith in God because it really does um, kind of focus me back on remembering that I don't have to do everything on my own, that I can lean on God, that I can trust on Him, that I can call upon Him when I am struggling. Hi, my name is Sean Edwison Henry and I live in Birmingham in the United Kingdom. I was born and raised in Jamaica so much of my youth was spent in Jamaica. But my young adult years in this country was um, extremely challenging because I had to learn very, very quickly how to integrate into a multicultural society. There were a lot of opportunities that were available to me, but I had to work twice as hard. It didn't matter what qualifications I had or the skills I had. I had to go above and beyond if I needed a particular promotion or a particular job. And I found that quite challenging. As a black person, I had to learn how to suppress a lot of my expressive nature. Um, not because I was embarrassed about who I was, but because I needed to survive in a system that I didn't find particularly welcoming. So I had to suppress a lot of my emotions. Um, I didn't want to be labeled as an angry black woman, so I suppressed a lot of who I was in order to get where I wanted to get to. Had it not been for my faith, I would not have been able to be calm. I would not have been able to face the challenges that I faced. I would not have been able to overcome the challenges I have overcome. So thanks to my faith, Thanks to the fact that I am a Christian, I have been able to deal with the challenges in a positive way and a professional way. So uh, my encouragement to any young person um, going through challenges or trying to survive in, in this country, trying to, to survive in a system which is not particularly keen on um, welcoming immigrants, as they call us, is to be positive, is to trust yourself and is to believe that you can achieve any dream that you want to.